Yeah. Of course. I have said this so many times. We don't have a single robber in the Federal House of Representatives talk less of making any of them a stamp. Most of the people you see there are credible men who have achieved a lot for themselves in their individual capacities. Who have developed themselves at various levels. Who have the mind of them of their own. Who are bold and courageous. Who will only start for what is right. And I tell you, I spend my time studying Right Honorable Femi Bajabi Amila. And I also spend my time, I, I was the one who pitched him for being the speaker. He, I didn't want, wait for him to call me up to join his campaign trail. I went to him during a dinner we had with Mr. President as candidate, not as elected, member elect. I told him, you are going to be the next speaker of the Ninth Assembly. I want to work with you. Give me your number. And he took photograph with me and he gave me his number. From that day, I joined his campaign and I followed him. I never missed any campaign. I never missed any meeting because I wanted to know him better. And within those period, we built a bond. I found out that this man is different from what people say about him. He's courageous. He's friendly. He's fatherly. He's patient. He's experienced. He's intelligent. He's a good manager of people. And I'm sure a man with such qualities will not be shying away from defending the position of this arm of government, the legislative arm, when there is an issue between it and other arms of government. Nobody is going to make Femi Bajabi Amila a rubber stamp. There is no intention, I can tell you that, that the executive on that president Muhammad Buhari, my president, is not intending to make either the Speaker of the House or the President of the Senate a rubber stamp because he's a man of integrity. And this man of integrity that has emerged now will take this country truly to the next level. Of course. Honorable Carlo has been preparing to represent his people for quite a long time. I came ready. I came ready. Watch this space. I came ready to profile solutions. I came ready to give assignment to the executives through good motions and laws that we're going to bring which they are supposed to carry out. And what happened today is the first test case for the executive who has been urged to step into the arena to profile solution agencies like the NEMA, the FEMA, the NDDC, they have been called upon to go to these areas I've mentioned and all the areas that the members of the Federal House of Representatives who showed interest in the amendment of the motion that I presented today mentioned for them to do the proper assessment and then we'll take it off from there. But I'm sure we're going to keep hope alive because solution is coming. So what the people should expect, both my constituents and Nigerians, is that we are here as solution provider. And under the leadership of Femi, Bajabi, Amila, and Wase, there's a lot that is going to be you know, uh, achieved during this his tenure. And you saw how he protected me while making the motion uh, because he believed in the motion he believed in the integrity of the motion and with that kind of relationship there's a lot we are out to achieve for nigerians